We all hear that it's important to have our vitamins and minerals as it helps us to achieve a healthy life. Vitamin C is an important dietary requirement that is commonly known to help fight the cold. But how true is that? And what is vitamin C actually good for? Well, what we do know is that vitamin C assists in the production of collagen, which is a protein that holds the body together, meaning without this you will literally fall apart. Vitamin C is also an antioxidant, which allows the removal of dangerous free radicals from the body. What are free radicals, you ask? Well, they are a special kind of molecule that have an unpaired electron in its outer orbit, making them highly reactive. And when you have too many of them in your body at once, they can cause some serious damage to your cells. Antioxidants like vitamin C, however, put a stop to that. Studies have also shown vitamin C to enhance the immune system and thus help fight a range of diseases like asthma, cardiovascular disease, eye diseases and even cancer. As for fighting a cold, studies have produced conflicting results, with the most compelling evidence done in 2013 where it found that among extremely active people such as marathon runners, taking at least 200 mg of vitamin C every day appeared to cut the risk of getting a cold in half. But as for the general population, taking daily vitamin C did not reduce the risk of getting a cold. It did, however, reduce the duration and symptoms of the cold. Lastly, vitamin C aids in iron absorption, which helps you maintain good energy levels and also helps to cure diabetes as it aids in the processing of insulin and glucose. So yes, vitamin C is one of these important dietary needs, and although the recommended daily intake of it being only 60 milligrams, research clearly shows that intakes can be much higher. So with that in mind, what are some good food sources of vitamin C? Guava is at the top of the list with an incredible 628% of your daily value per cup. Capsicum is about half of that, with the yellow capsicums having the most vitamin C of its kind averaging at 305% per cup. The kiwi fruit has 273% per cup. Oranges have 146. Papaya and strawberries have 142. The vegetable broccoli has 137%. Kale has 133. Pineapple has 131%. And rockamelon has only two digits per cup, averaging out about 98% of your daily value. So next time you're having a meal, why not add some of these vitamin C dense foods to your diet, helping you make that next step to a healthier you. Want to learn more about health? Why not subscribe for more videos?